we will create a function load underscore data equ parameter in it we will write our ajax in which there will be two things url comma data comma our uh, success which will load a function which we will doing and the thing uh, last thing will be url data and uh, our fourth thing will be fourth thing will be the method which we will be using Fetching our data for data using QB and the method we will be using POST post. And now, uh, in the success function, success function, we will be loading our data that we will receive in case of success and which we will be showing in our. Table which will be naming as in our result deviant. I will create a deviant now by giving it an ID RESU LT result. In this deviant, we will be loading our data success function method post ajax. After this function, we will write the event through which we will be loading our data. We want it to be loaded in a manner in which when we press the key. So we will be using the key of event. Dollar and we will give this input field an ID. Search underscore data. Grab the value of this input field and store into a variable. Let's name it as search. Search as word search and uh, this dot val function. This will grab the value inside the field input field and store it in the search variable. In case this search variable doesn't hold any value not equal to D. Sorry, I forgot to write the function here. So, in case if the uh, if the input field is empty or the result doesn't match, then it will not load our function that we've created above. with the printed result other than that it will load it with the filtered result sorry i swapped the results now our view page is ready Create our function. Function fetch. Okay. 
so what we actually want is that we want to load a complete table if in case there is uh, the user types something so in that case we want the filtered data other than that we want all data in the form of table so for that we will be storing the input of user into a variable and passing it to the model so we will be loading our model first we will create a model afterwards we will name it as main model let's create a model first we will go into the model folder create a new file there name it as a main model.php If the user has typed something into the input field, then it should take that and give it uh, give us data. According to that, by filtering the data. So, if the user has typed something. Then it should take that input and store it in a variable data. With these, we will create two variables which we will be using. Dollar data and it should store it in it in the dollar data and then it should load that that particular model dollar this main underscore model and the function we will name it as fetch data passing the dollar data now let's name it as can be variable. So now we will go to our main model and we will create the function named as fetch underscore data through which we will be get our variable or you can name it as the data this db select Select all this DB from sorry from the table in that we will create now in a few minutes. I am going to name it as uh, student. If in case the dollar data, the pass data, is, or the user has same uh, user has passed something or typed something. Then it should give the data in a filtered form all our, our required data then this will give we will search it on basis of name you can add other fields too like email last name age etc Now it will search on uh, three terms on the basis of three. Uh, let's search it on so now this will select that.